Hi, I'm Ehsan Bahrami and welcome to this video. Today we are diving into the complete roadmap for learning front-end development from zero to hero. If you've always wanted a clear guide on where to start and how to become a professional front-end developer, this video is just for you. Uh, this roadmap is the result of over a decade of experience in software engineering, uh, combined with insights from uh, trusted sources. Uh, so you don't have to sift uh, through countless roadmaps on your own. Whether you're just starting out or you've already taken a few steps, uh, this guide is designed uh, to be your mentor along the way. So uh, stick around until the uh, end of this video. Before we jump into the roadmap, I'd recommend it uh, subscribing to the channel, hitting the bell icon, and setting it to all, so you get notified as soon as I upload a new video, uh, and you don't lose track of the channel. Also, if you enjoy this video, feel free to give it a like and drop a comment. It really helps uh, keep me motivated. Frontend development is an exciting field that lets you build a functional and interactive UI. Uh, with the right skills, you'll be able to make things happen uh, with your code like updating a table's content or opening a new form uh, when a button is clicked. In this video, we'll go step by step through everything you need uh, to become a skilled front-end developer. Step 0. Understanding Web and Internet Basics the web is full of uh, terms that might seem overwhelming uh, at first. But once you understand the concept, you'll see they're not as intimidating as they sound. Why should you learn uh, these basics? Uh, because uh, like any other field, understanding the terminology helps uh, you uh, grasp uh, the concepts better and ensures nothing remains unclear. Uh, you'll learn about things like what is the internet and how does it work, uh, what are hosting and servers, uh, browsers, HTTP, IP addresses, domains, DNS, and many more terms you'll encounter on your journey. Step 1. Learning HTML. Every website or web app uh, starts uh, with HTML. It's the backbone of any web page. Here's what you'll focus on. HTML basics and core concepts, elements and tags, forms and validation, and more. Step 2. Learning CSS. The first thing uh, users notice about a website is its visual appeal, and CSS is what makes uh, that possible. From colors to layout, CSS brings your page to life. In this stage, you'll learn CSS fundamentals, selectors, styling techniques, uh, fonts, and more. Step 3. Learning JavaScript. JavaScript is the magic behind interactive and uh, dynamic uh, websites. It's arguably the most uh, critical skill for any front-end developer. Not only does it make your page interactive, but it also has back-end applications. You'll cover topics like uh, programming fundamentals, loops, conditional statements, fetch API, and more. Step 4. Mastering tools. Front-end tools make your work faster, easier, and more efficient. A good developer knows their uh, tools well. Uh, here are some essential ones. Integrated development uh, environment IDEs, uh, like VS Code. Version control systems like Git. Platforms like GitHub or GitLab, package managers, build tools like linters, formatters, and module bundlers. Step 5. Learning responsive design. With most users browsing on uh, mobile devices, uh, your designs need to adapt seamlessly to different screen sizes. Uh, responsive design ensures your website looks great on laptops, tablets, and smartphones alike. Step 6. Exploring frameworks and libraries. Once you're uh, comfortable with HTML, CSS, and JavaScript, it's time to speed things up. 
with frameworks and libraries. These tools provide powerful features that streamline development. For CSS, Tailwind or Bootstrap, learning uh, one is enough. For JavaScript, React.js or Vue.js for libraries and Next.js or Nux.js for frameworks. One library and one framework are sufficient. Step 7. Learning software testing. A stable and reliable application requires complete testing. Learn to write tests that cover different parts of your project. Uh, tools like Cypress, Playwright, Jest, and Vtest are great tools to learn. Uh, you don't need to learn them all at once. Step 8. Understanding Web Security Basics. Security is uh, crucial in software development. Protecting your application from vulnerabilities ensures uh, user trust and data safety. You'll learn uh, secure authentication methods like JOT or OAuth. Uh, basic security concepts like HTTPS, CORS, and more. Step 9. Learning advanced topics uh, to level up. To stand out as a front-end developer, it's important to explore topics that elevate your skills and make you a more versatile professional. Here are some key areas to focus on. SEO basics, understanding how search engines work and optimizing your web pages for better rankings. Software engineering uh, principles, learn concepts like design patterns and how to write maintainable and scalable code. TypeScript, a strongly typed superset of JavaScript that improves code quality and reduces bugs. CSS preprocessors, tools like SAS or post CSS that enhance CSS capabilities and improve workflow. BIM methodology, a systematic approach to writing clean, uh, reusable CSS code. SSR and SSG concepts, server side rendering and a static site uh, generation for optimizing uh, performance and SEO. Uh, mobile front-end development. Tools like uh, React Native or Flutter for building cross-platform mobile apps. Desktop front-end development. Uh, explore technologies like Electron or Flutter for creating desktop applications. GraphQL. A query language for APIs that offers more flexibility compared to REST. Progressive Web Apps PWA. Learn how to create web apps that feel and perform like native apps. These topics will uh, help you expand uh, your skill set and explore exciting areas of front end development. Step 10 Entering the uh, job market. After mastering the previous steps, it's time to showcase your skills professionally. Being able to present yourself effectively is just as important as the technical knowledge you've gained. Uh, here's how to prepare. Build professional projects and a portfolio. Create a portfolio showcasing your best work, uh, whether it's demo uh, projects or uh, real world applications. Set up a complete uh, LinkedIn profile. Uh, keep your uh, profile updated with accurate information about your skills and experience. Create a GitHub account. Share your project and code with potential employers. Leverage social media. Use platforms like X or Instagram to share your expertise and connect with others in the tech community. Network with professionals. Attend meetups, participate in online forums, or join communities to expand uh, your connections. Apply for jobs. Use uh, company websites, LinkedIn, or job boards to apply for roles that align with your skills. You can start interning as early as completing step three, but it's uh, advisable to follow the roadmap uh, to its end. Practical experience during learning is crucial, but starting too early without sufficient knowledge may limit the value of your internship. Always aim for a balanced mix of theory and hands-on practice to maximize your learning and growth. Final notes. Before wrapping up, 
let's discuss some important points. Continuous learning. The world of programming evolves rapidly and staying up to date is key to success. Always uh, be curious and never stop exploring new technologies and trends. Practice makes perfect. Theoretical and the knowledge alone is not enough. Regular coding practice and working on projects uh, will solidify your understanding and ensure long-term uh, retention. Project-based learning. When uh, choosing courses or uh, tutorials, prioritize uh, ones that emphasize hands-on projects and practical exercises. This is the complete roadmap to becoming a front-end developer from scratch. If you enjoyed this video, uh, make sure to like and share it. In the comments, let me know which stage you're at or what topics you'd like us to cover in the future. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more videos. See you in the next video. Bye for now.